today's YouTube video, I decided to use the Cast Off 762 as my final gun to use in Modern Warfare 2. Since Modern Warfare 3 is coming out in a couple days, and the time I upload this video is probably coming out in like two or three days, this will be my last video on Modern Warfare 2 using the new buffed Cast Off 762. Infinity War decided to buff cast off 762's close range damage, so I decided to make an updated class setup. And I was like, why not? The guns are gonna be in Modern Warfare 3, and this class setup might still be viable. And honestly, the 762 is a very strong gun. I end up dropping an insane MGB with this weapon. But before I get into the class setup, I'm gonna show you guys my stats in Modern Warfare 2. Then I'm gonna go into the class setup. Then I'm gonna show the insane MGB gameplay using the class setup. Alrighty, guys, these are my final stats in Modern Warfare 2. And I have about almost eight days played which I didn't play Modern Warfare 2 much at all. I got a 3.27 KD and a 1.30 win-loss ratio. I tried to find the medals, which I don't know why the hell it's not in the game. I looked everywhere. I couldn't find them. If they are in the game, someone let me know down in the comments. But based on what I see, they're not in the game, which is kind of dumb. So I don't even know how many MGBs I got in this game. But what I do know is there is a mastery calling card where you call in like 10 mgbs and i have it and i'm gonna show you guys that in a minute but first i got a 736 score per minute and i got 54,529 kills and 16,690 deaths my highest kill or my highest gun streak i should say is a 53 and my highest kills is 154 in one game which by the way was with the new tr76 which happened like a week ago when i was trying to level up the weapon Alrighty guys, we're at the calling cards while I was telling you guys about uh, where it shows how many MGBs you have. There, here it is, MGB Mastery. One MGB, this is the calling card. Three MGBs, this is the calling card. Five, that's the calling card. And 10 of them, this is the calling card. But you have to call them in like it says above the calling card. And if you get all four of these, you unlock the mastery calling card, which I did. And honestly, it looks pretty solid. This is the literally my first time ever putting it on today. I didn't even know I had it. I was just looking through calling cards. I was like, I've never looked at the calling cards at all once. Now I did. First time. And this is a calling card. They should have this in Modern Warfare 3. It's actually pretty smart. I do like how it has more than just one calling card for a nuke. It has a, you call in several nukes, you get a calling card type of thing, which I like the idea. But now let's get into my class setup on the cast off 762. Then let's get into the MGB gameplay right after. For the first attachment, I was running the 40 round mag. This attachment can't be tuned. So let's get into the next one. For the second attachment, I was running the demo X2 grip. These are the tunings I was running. I went towards ADS and sprint to fire. And the reason I chose these tunings is because I wanted the cast off 762 to be faster since it's an AR and it's a heavy one at that. And the reason I chose this attachment is to help out with this recoil. For the third attachment, I was running the Pro Light TL3 stock. These are tunings I was running on towards ADS and aim walking speed. ADS aim down faster, aim walking speed to stray faster. You don't want to be a standstill target. And the reason I chose this attachment is the same reason as before, speed, because the cast off really is a slow AR. For the fourth attachment, I was running the FSSV laser. These are tunings I was running on towards ADS, sprint to fire. ADS aim down faster again, sprint to fire, pull the weapon down faster. And for the fifth and final attachment, I was running the SA leveler. These are tunings I was running on towards recoil stabilization and recoil control recoil stabilization so my gun is stable while i'm shooting it and recoil control so my gun has no recoil and also doesn't have visual recoil which makes it harder to land shots and the reason i chose this attachment is because it gets horizontal and vertical recoil which helps out with this recoil pattern once again but yeah anyways let me know your guys thoughts down in the comments about modern warfare 3 and are you guys hyped for it or do you guys not really care but not that's over let's get into this insane mgb gameplay using this cast off 762 class setup all righty guys we're using the cast off 762 for the final gun I'm going to use for Modern Warfare 2 on my final video. I decided to use the 762 because, well, I didn't know what else to post upon and I saw that it's close range damage got buffed. So I was like, why not? I guess we'll have this as a filler episode type thing. And okay. And honestly, the, ca the cast off 762 is just naturally disgusting, so... Cool. So I spawn here. I take two steps forward and then they spawn here. And I, man, I'm so glad that Modern Warfare 3 has speed. Man, being able to reload cancel, which I don't know why the hell I didn't see anything about fast mags. That needs to be brought back ASAP. Like, it's modern day games, bro. Why the hell is there no fast mags? Can I move, or y'all just gonna keep spawning them on me, bro? Y'all just gonna keep spawning them on me? Cool! Oh, 
Bro, what are these? Fu he literally spawned in front of me. Not even around the corner. Bro, they're trying to get me killed. They're doing everything they can. Everything. I know you guys see that the enemies have spawned on me like nine times. Bro, I'm too scared to move because they're just sitting here all focusing me and they keep spawning on me. Snap nades? Snap nades? Bro, come on. I'm not pushing that corner. Can I like stop being spammed by explosives? I'm barely on a brutal? Bruh, I saw brutal like five minutes ago. He's just sitting there preamming that, bruh. Thank you for the MGB. Let's go. One dude on my team putting in some work, though. All right, I'm going to give him maybe a few more seconds. All right. No, 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 no. No! Bro, I... I forgot it was this game mode. Oh, bro, I tried to call it out. It, it literally went from seconds to just 90 and it was there. Oh, I didn't get to call out my nuke. Damn, that dude went 56 and 2. Oh, bro, I was going to call it out. I saw 80 points. I was like, oh, yeah, I can make that. Then all of a sudden, it went from 80 to 95 in seconds. Like, what the hell, bro? Oh, I still got the nuke. It's whatever. But yeah, anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you're new. Don't forget to slap on the post notifications so you miss the latest and greatest videos. And I'll see you later, guys. Peace.